much less the government. Well, I mean, here we are forced to pay up for all everyday items because inflation was stoked because of bad policy. And there's no accountability. They're just pushing through their new $5 trillion reconciliation plan. And there's no accountability for Fauci. Look, we know that he lied <laughs> under oath. It, it, will there be any accountability for lying to your face? We've referred him to the Department of Justice, but then again, Merrick Garland is the one now going after parents that go to school board meetings. So I don't have a lot of hope that he is actually going to be an object objectively looking at Fauci's lying. But Fauci should go to prison for five years for lying to Congress. They've prosecuted other people. They've selectively gone after Republicans. But in no way will they do anything about him lying. But he should be prosecuted for lying. But at the very least, he should be taken out of his position because I think he costs people lives through misinformation. Every time he tells people, oh, wear a cloth mask, he's actually endangering people. If you're around someone with COVID, you don't want to wear a cloth mask because they don't work. Wow. Uh, that's a really important point that you make. Senator, it's good to see you. Thanks very much. Thank you. Senator Rand Paul joining us this morning. We'll see you soon, sir. Thank you. Quick break. A citizenship slam dunk. Boston Celtics star Ennis Cantor Freedom is here on his American citizenship. And he is calling out of the NBA over its silence on China's bad behavior. He's coming up next. We need a bond on this project. I asked Markham. You know what? Here's an idea. 